Hi class. Today, we are going to learn about being a good citizen. What is a citizen? A citizen is a member of a group or community. It can be member, a member of a large group, like a city or a town, or a small community, like our school and our classroom. All good citizens have some traits that they share. The first trait of a good citizen is honesty. Honesty means that you always tell the truth, even sometimes when it's hard. The second trait is a good citizen always shows compassion. Compassion means that you care about others and other living things. It means that you will do what you can to help them, no matter what. The third trait is good citizens show respect. Respect is kind of like compassion, but respect can be towards non-living things, like respecting the rules, that means you're going to follow them. And respecting the environment means you're not going to go throw trash on the ground. The fourth is a good citizen shows responsibility. Responsibility is what a person should do. A responsible person always does his or her homework. The fifth trait of a good citizen that we are going to learn about is the last one, and that trait is courage. Courage is more than about just being tough. It's about doing the right thing, even when the right thing is scary, or even when others aren't doing the right thing. Citizens should also help their community because they respect it and care about it. You can help the community alone or with a group of people. Like, when you see a piece of trash on the street, you can pick that up. And that's you helping the community alone. But another way to help the community is by having a fundraiser. Baking cookies and selling them for the local animal shelter with a group of people. Now, that's a group project. When you work to help the community, you are working for the common good, the good of all people. Everyone has the responsibility to help the community run smoothly. One way to help the community run smoothly is by obeying the laws. What is a law? A law is a rule that tells you how to behave. It also tells me how to behave. <laughs> a law that tells us to wear our seatbelts, and there's a law that tells us to wear a bike helmet when we ride our bikes, but there are also laws telling us not to do things, like not to steal, and not to throw our trash in the ground, not to litter. Laws help keep people safe, and they help to make sure that everybody's treated fairly, and they protect our rights as people. A right that's a freedom, a freedom that's protected by the government. We have rights and responsibilities in school. We have the right to be safe, but with that right comes the responsibility to follow the safety rules in order to keep ourselves and others safe. So following the rules is a right and a responsibility. Some other responsibilities that we have are doing chores at home and being respectful of other people's cultures. Being able to understand that not everybody's like us and not be mean to them because of that. We have the right to make choices, but we have the responsibility to make good choices good choices that are following the law and other rules, like our classroom rules. You have the right to live in a clean and healthy place, but you have a responsibility 
to do your part in keeping the community where you live clean by picking up any trash on the streets that you may see or not throwing your trash on the ground. And you can also recycle, which helps there to be less trash in the trash dumps. You have the right to be a good member of your community. Take advantage of these rights and remember ways to be a good citizen, like being honest, showing compassion, respect, and being responsible, and being courageous. Remember these and think of some other ways that you can be a good citizen and be ready to share them in class tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great afternoon.